Hey guys, welcome to the May 2021 Keto Crate Unboxing. My name is Autumn from the YouTube channel Watch Autumn Keto. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and share this video with a friend so that they know all about the great stuff that's in this month's Keto Crate. To be honest, I don't know if it's great. I haven't opened it yet, but <laughs> that's why we're here. Stick around to the end of this video to see how you can win your very own May Keto Crate, or if you can't wait and you want one now, you can use the link in the description below to get a discount on your very first Keto Crate. All right, let's go. Opening the crate. Well, gonna need these. All right, first of all, they done done it again, okay? If you watched my April Keto Crate unboxing, you know that there were two meat sticks and I specifically wrote a strongly worded letter to Keto Crate telling them that one meat stick is enough. But apparently here we are, we're back. So let's start with field trip. Oh, wait a minute, buffalo style chicken stick. I take it all back. I want to try this. Absolutely, this is I mean, don't get me wrong, it's a meat stick and I hate meat sticks, but I love spicy food and I love buffalo chicken flavored things in general. So this is a conundrum we have here. Like I can't wait to, to taste this. Per stick, there are 60 calories, one and a half grams of fat. There are less than one total carb. I am here for it. And there are 10 grams of protein. The ingredients are chicken, dried apples, sea salt, spices. And let me see, no sugar, no sugar, no sugar. Winter field trip, absolutely. Winner, winner, chicken stick dinner, right? Okay, I am, I'm actually really excited to try this. I take it all back. Okay, so maybe I'm excited to try this too. This is a yoba yo. I've definitely had these before. What is this word, you guys? What is that word? I don't know. It is a traditional South African family recipe, proudly made in the USA, handcrafted with 100% grass-fed beef. Okay, like this is like a jerky stick. I don't know if you can see, but like, it is dry. Oh, ow! <laughs> you can give somebody a whooping with one of these. Who needs a switch? When you have an ayoba yo, what is this even? Is this biltong or is this just jerky? Like you guys, what is happening? I mean, this is meat licorice. Like I have no idea. Okay, so the nutritional information. Okay, serving size one stick. Okay, 90 calories, two and a half grams of fat, zero carbs. I'm 100% here for that. And then 16 grams of sugar. My hand is still stinging. Like I am gonna, you can't squeeze this. You guys, I take it back. As long as they're sending meat stick mysteries, send all the meat sticks, okay? Like, okay, next we have pure organic sugar-free chocolate drink mix. I've definitely had this before. This is like a chocolate milk mix-in. Oh, it was pretty regular. If you're looking for chocolate milk and you don't have cocoa and erythritol or stevia on hand, sure, this is a great replacement. Other than that, like, it's just too easy to make yourself for me to think this is worth it. But still, you can use eight ounces of milk alternative per one packet. Uh, the ingredients, cocoa powder, erythritol. <laughs> I have those upstairs, like come on now. But still, like once again, it's all about the convenience. Serving size, one packet, 10 calories, zero everything except four grams of carbs two grams of erythritol, so two, okay, so one gram of fiber, so that's one net carb per serving. I mean, there is like xanthan gum and other sorts of gum in here, I guess, to make the consistency thicker. Still, not worth it, but I mean, we're gonna try it. Next, we have ketogenic, does this say keho? I don't know. Curry in a hurry, savory bite. First of all, you win on the naming convention. Does that say keho? What'd you just call me? Um, this is, I mean, I've never seen this before. It's like a savory bar. Y'all know I love bars, but like, am I gonna like this bar though? That is really interesting. 17 grams of fat, four net carbs, 11 grams of fiber. This is interesting. Oh, look at the back. Kiho is Finnish for a living human body. I am a Kiho, all right? Learn something new every day here on the Keto Crate Unboxing. Calories, 200 calories for one bar, 17 grams of fat, 15 grams of carbs, 11 fiber, so that's four net carbs, and then five grams of protein. 
what are the ingredients in this? Like, what do I want a spicy bar for? So the first ingredient, prebiotic, soluble, tapioca fiber. Then we got pecans, almonds, macadamias. Oh, so it's like a nut bar, like a savory nut bar. Ooh, y'all know how I feel about savory nuts. Cauliflower, pearls, spinach, coconut flakes. What is happening this month in the keto crate? When I tell you I have never, never, ever heard of this or thought to myself, do you know what I want? A savory curry bar, you know? But I am going to be very, very interested to try this. That is nuts. Next we have, oh my gosh, Snack House Keto Cereal Fruity Rubbles. Well, absolutely I'll have a Fruity Rubble Snack House. Thank you for giving them to me. Go ahead, have two bowls. No, absolutely not. That is, don't put that on a package, okay? Challenge accepted. Uh, this is just Fruity Cereal Puffs. Oh, oh, I hope these are good. Serving size, one package, 115 calories, five grams of fat, eight total carbs seven allulose so that's one net carb okay the ingredients milk protein isolate allulose palm kernel oil whey protein concentrate so yeah these are just protein puffs but i'm telling you if the fruity flavor is there i'm in there okay next we have oh oh monk pack keto granola bar yes 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 love 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 absolutely one of my favorites peanut butter oh yes i'll take a peanut butter thank you very much one gram of sugar two net carbs you can't tell me nothing there are 140 calories 12 grams of fat 12 total carbs four fiber 0.5 glycerin but you know there's some allulose in here and then five grams of protein yeah, so that makes it two net carbs. Let's look at some of the ingredients. Peanuts, almonds, allulose, peanut butter, sunflower seeds, coconut, soluble tapioca fiber, flax seeds. I mean, these things taste delicious. Like, I am absolutely here for this. Monk Pack is one of my favorite keto products out there. I am very excited. Round two alert. Okay, another one of my favorite keto products, Keto Farms Maple Candied Pecans. We have absolutely received these in the Keto Crate before, and they are delicious. Serving size, one package, 150 calories, 16 grams of fat, 10 grams of carb, two fiber, seven erythritol, so that's one net carb. Yes, please. Uh, and then two grams of protein. You guys, they literally look exactly like this. Like, like just delicious candied pecans. Every time the subject comes up, you know I have got to ask. Comment down below, team pecan or team pecan? Team pecan? Does, does anyone say pecan? Is it pecan? Pecan? You sound like a, you sound like a chicken. Pecan? Pecan? No. Look, team pecan or team pecan? Let me know down below. I'm, I'm going to love you no matter what, but still, I'm going to judge you depending on which one you choose. You know what I'm saying? Um, these are absolutely delicious. I love them. I know I love them. Can't wait to try them. Oh, no. Oh, what? We've got good to go strawberry macadamia nut. Now, you guys, you know, normally I don't like fruit flavored things, but I'm still probably going to love this. Like, I love good to go bars. They're, they're pillowy, muffiny, delicious Oh, oh, just delicious muffin-like bars, and I'm obsessed with them. I don't know if I've ever had this flavor. My favorite flavor is, I'm going to say, like, there's like a vanilla one out there, but boy, these are delicious. 170 calories, 14 grams of fat, 16 total carbs, 7 fiber, 5 erythritol. That means there are 4 net carbs. Worth it! Uh, and then 5 grams of protein. Like, I am going to be really, really excited to try those. Oh, Oh my God, there is an entire jar of pure hazelnut spread in here. What? How much does this cost? You guys, that's why I love the Keto Crate because sometimes they be coming with some like high dollar items where you're just like, what? Oh my gosh, I love me a hazelnut spread. Oh my gosh. Now, Lakanto has a delicious hazelnut spread, chocolate hazelnut spread called Suntella. You can actually get 10% off your Lakanto purchase if you use the link in the description box below. But like, I've never tried this one before, but I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Pure organic hazelnut spread with cocoa. Y'all done done it now, Pure. Y'all done done it now. Servings, about 10 false servings, one. 
right? Uh, amount per serving, two tablespoons, 35 grams, 140 calories per serving, 11 grams of fat. Woo, 19 total carbs, Lord Jesus. Seven fiber and seven erythritol. So that's five net carbs or is there some sort of allulose in here? And then three grams of protein. What is it? How many net carbs per serving? Is that, is that still five net carbs a serving? I don't know, but like, this is crazy. Not really keen on the fact that there is added sugar and that the ingredients are organic vegetable oils and organic fats, organic sunflower oil, organic coconut oil, organic cocoa blends, organic erythritol, organic tapioca fiber, hazelnuts, cocoa powder, organic sunflower lecithin. Okay, I mean, this is, you don't have to put organic in front of everything or do you? I don't know, but like, Regardless, not a fan of like the first ingredients being like vegetable oils, but I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna eat all this, <laughs> okay? So I can't wait to try it. I mean, who's, who knows? I might not even like it. Find that hard to believe, but still it's possible because I've never had this before. Not even sure I knew it existed and now I have a whole jar of it. So I'm very excited. Oh, what I'm also excited about is a s'mort cake. Oh, I feel so s'more eating a s'mort cake. This flavor is vanilla latte. Ooh, I bet this is gonna be vanilla-y and like coffee-y and delicious. My husband absolutely loves a s'mort cakes. So there are two servings per container. I'm gonna read the per container because that's how we would eat the s'mort cakes. Uh, 76 calories, five grams of fat, 18 total carbs, 10 grams of fiber and eight grams of erythritol. Yes, that's right, people. Allegedly, there are zero net carbs in a smart cake. I mean, don't be wrong. They're basically air, but they're delicious air. You know what I'm saying? So I could, I could believe that there are zero net carbs and then eight grams of protein. The ingredients, eggs, water, ooh, a proprietary fiber blend. There is oat fiber, corn fiber, and flax. Then there's erythritol, whey protein, olive oil, pure vanilla, cinnamon. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's a little bit of a science experiment, but they're delicious, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, next we have, ah, oh, some porking good pork rinds. Onion and sour cream. This is gonna be delicious. Now, the porking good pork rinds are some of my favorite. The salted butter pork rinds, hands down my favorite pork rinds on the market, but sour cream and onion is all right with me. So there are three and a half servings per container. Jeez Louise, well, I would eat this whole thing. Per serving, there are 80 calories, five grams of fat, zero carbs, and eight grams of protein. See, that's why I don't like when they split the serving up into like such small pieces, because yeah, per serving, you probably do have zero carbs, but with the spices in here, there are 100% carbs. Like this is misleading because it seems like if you eat all three and a half servings, that's still zero carbs because three and a half times zero is zero. Math major, but there are spices in here. Like there are carbs. So I would count this as like one carb, maybe two carbs, not a lot, but that's not the point. Accuracy, that's all we ask for, transparency. I mean, but these things are delicious. Ingredients, pork rinds cooked in pork fat. Ooh, I love that. Dry milk, onion powder, salt, lactic acid, parsley flakes. Now I do absolutely love that they are cooked in pork fat and not fried in some sort of bad oil. I absolutely love it, I take it all back. Next we have, ooh, intact snacks. This is crunchy cheese, the Mediterranean mix. I have had this before and I have thought to myself, what? is Mediterranean cheese. Comment down below, what's Mediterranean cheese? Either way, these are just like moon cheese. I really do like them. There are two servings per container. There are 80 calories per serving, six grams of fat, less than one carb per serving, and then five grams of protein. Once again, I'm eating this whole bag. This is a really nice crunchy snack. I do like these. I forget what I felt about this flavor, so I'm excited to try it again. The ingredients, cheese, Tomato powder, basil, oregano, and salt. Interesting. Okay, I'll be excited to try them. Next we have, mmm, super fat keto cookie bites, double dark chocolate chip. Ooh, them's all some of my favorite words, right? And to be put together like that. 
Keto Cookie Bites. There are two servings per container, but thankfully they do put the per container nutrition facts on here as well, cause that's how I'm gonna eat these. Uh, so per container, 260 calories, 24 grams of fat, 25 total carbs, six fiber, 13 sugar alcohol, and then eight grams of protein. So there are three grams net carbs per serving, which means six net carbs per bag. I mean, that's okay for a whole bag of double chocolate, what? Double dark chocolate chip cookies, absolutely. And then finally, hmm, we have Fat Snacks Almond Flour Crackers, the everything variety. Now, I am personally not a fan of everything flavored things, uh, but I do remember having the cheese fat snacks crackers and i like them so i'm interested to try these i've never tried them before i've never bought them so i'm really glad that i received them in the keto crate there are two servings per container there are 130 calories per serving 11 grams of fat six carbs three fiber so that's three net carbs per serving once again six net carbs per container not too bad and then five grams of protein i'm excited to try these I can already tell, like, it seems like they'd be great for dipping, great, like a great crunchy snack. So hopefully they're just that. The ingredients are almond flour, egg whites, butter, cream cheese, coconut flour. Okay, I mean, these, those sound like pretty whole clean ingredients. So that makes me even more excited to try these. So I'm glad that I received them in this month's Keto Crate. Okay, guys, that is it. And might I say, this keto crate is lit, okay? It has my mix of favorite things. Number one, things I've never, never, never heard of before, right? Number two, things that I have heard of and have been wanting to try, but never got around to it. Number three, different flavors of products that I already know that I like. And then number four, things I know I don't like, but I'm just gonna try anyways, right? I know. But there were just so many new different items in here and you guys you can't ignore the retail value how much does all this stuff cost put together i'm not doing that work but i can only assume a great amount this is a great value right here not only because you get to try a different variety of snacks in my opinion that's the number one value but number two a lot of the stuff comes in like six packs and 12 packs. You can't really just get a sample by itself. So I love that the Keto Crate provides that. And if you want a discount on your own Keto Crate, go ahead and use the link in the description box below, or you can comment down below to let me know which one of these items you would be most excited to try. And we will draw a winner on this month's episode of Smash the Crate. That's where my family and I try every single product in this month's Keto Crate. Comment on this video, you're automatically entered to win. But to be honest, I buy my own Keto Crate for this alone. Like you guys, I'm pumped. I am excited. I don't know if it's the chocolate. I don't know if it's the hazelnut spread. I don't know if it is the nostalgia, but what? Thanks so much for joining me. Don't forget, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe to this channel for more keto content, and I'll catch you on Smash the Crate. Bye.